And we welcome you back to 3 News at 5, live from Canton, Ohio. The Pro Football Hall of Fame and the Village are alive today. Fans from all over the country are here in Canton. Of course, they're here for induction weekend. It all kicks off tonight with the Hall of Fame game, Browns and Jets. It comes your way 8 o'clock here on 3 News. And there are so many new things here to do. Mike Crawford, the CEO of Hall of Fame Village, is with us now on set. I'm sure that you've had a very lovely, relaxing week it's so far, right? It's absolutely <laughs> relaxing. We've got nothing going on. No, it's been fantastic. Yeah, it's so talk great. to us. We've been talking all week about how people will come down here and not understand all that you have to offer. What have you put into this the last it's, few It years? is exactly how you said it. People come down, the first three letters out of their mouth are, wow, W-O-W, -W, we didn't know all of this stuff was here. We're marketing it, but having the Browns here is probably the best marketing of all, getting Cleveland to come down here and see Play Action Plaza with our wheel and red zone and new two new rides, first down fest, all the things we have going out there. So a lot of great activity and it's fun to see these thousands of people down here walking around right now. Not yeah. to mention my favorite, the zip line. The zip line. Have I'm you been on it? I'm always in on the zip line. No, I've been trying to find time to do oh, it all yeah. week. Hopefully I can do it tomorrow when things slow down just uh, a little bit. And now, as if all of this isn't enough, next year there's going to be a water park. You got to keep Tell adding us about stuff. That. You hey, got to keep that's adding. Right. No, football themed water park, the only one in America, wow. over 100,000 square feet. So we're thrilled. And I wish it was just two weeks later because the building starts to go up. The steel <laughs> is going up now, oh. but it's okay. Everybody will come down next year. And then we've got a hotel, football team themed hotel right beside it that will connect and it'll keep adding more and more to the experience. It feels like a football theme park. You kind of have to be that around the Pro Football Hall of Fame, don't wow. you think? Yeah, it's a great idea. I mean, it goes we're very together, lucky. doesn't it? It does. Yeah, they complement each other. Yeah, it does. So this is kind of our, the Hall of Fame Super Bowl, it is. you know, really at the end of the day. What does it take for you to put this thing together? Oh, it's months of planning. I mean, it really is. It's like the Super Bowl. You have to plan for safety and security. You got to plan for show. We've got vendors everywhere. We've got to have enough beverages, adult beverages for everybody. But no, it's a lot of coordination to have it be a really fun, seamless experience for our guests without them having to think about it. And football fans, as you know, love being in these kinds of environments. So it's months of planning for this. Well, when all this is over, I want you to take a couple days off. And then I want you to start planning for next year's Absolutely. Hall of Fame because I'm yeah. sure that's what it'll be. Uh, do you have a pick for tonight? Is it the Browns or is it I, I the I was going to wear my Joe Thomas jersey, and I thought, I wish well, you would have. I, I, I can't. I've got to stand by us, but the I Browns. Know. I got. I mean, I grew up in Ohio. I have to root for the Browns. Mike, thank you so, thank much. You so much. We appreciate Great it. Great to see you Brian guys. Crawford. And, and here's a line. I love this. Love what you've done with the place. Thank you very much. Really Come nice. back anytime. <laughs> love to have you.